Hi everyone today, we're going to take a look at the 5 best exterior primer paint on the market for this year. First we're going to show you our 5 best picks, then we'll talk about what you should look for before buying a best exterior primer paint. You can find timestamps and links to all the products we mentioned in this video down in the description below. Let's get started. It is very difficult to find a good primer, particularly when you want to paint an outdoor surface. With the elements of nature being often unpredictable, you have to find the best exterior primer. But considering the multitude of choices, which one would work best for you? Paint job after paint job, I've dealt with exterior primers before. I know that interior surfaces behave differently from the exterior kind. Based on my knowledge, I can help you pick the best primer for every exterior wood project. This way, you won't have to go through the trouble yourself. Product Reviews, Updated List We've listed 5 best exterior primer paint reviews you can rely on to complete your project. The features and benefits will guide you to pick the best. Number 1. Kills Prem 13041 Exterior Primer Paint Used in a variety of projects, for interior and exterior surfaces alike, the Kills Premium High Height Primer is a favorite choice. It has very powerful stain blocking properties and sports a 300 to 400 square feet coverage. This is a water-based primer, which means that its toxicity is very low. It also doesn't smell as much, meaning that it's safe to paint without a mask, although using one still won't hurt. It is labeled as interior slash exterior primer, which means that you may use the remaining primer to finish indoor projects as well. The adhesion is smooth and covers imperfections even on porous wood. Compared to other primers for exterior surfaces, this primer is mold and mildew resistant. It works great under oil-based or latex paint, and you may use it for both color updates or a full color change. It can also be used on a variety of other surfaces. As an example, you may also proceed to paint the metal handles after you are done with the wood fence. The formula of this latex primer is fast drying, which can be both an advantage and a disadvantage. It's perfect if you need to finish the project fast, but you also need to work just as quickly. Otherwise, it might leave brush marks. Pros. Mildew resistant formula, acts as both primer and sealer. Water-based formula that dries quickly, low toxicity and odor. Cons. Since it dries quickly, you need to work fast. It may leave brush marks. Number 2. Zinsser 02004 Exterior Primer Paint Compared to the Kills Premium High High Primer, which is on the high-range price side, this exterior primer is more affordable. With that in mind, even if the price is low, it does not lack in terms of quality. Meant for both interior and exterior use, this product is highly versatile. Like the High High from Kills, you may use it on various surface types, i.e. wood, plastic, metal. Likewise, this water-based primer features a rust inhibitor, making it a great option for rust-prone surfaces. The composition of this primer is antibacterial to prevent mold growth. This exterior latex primer also has stain-blocking properties. Whether you are dealing with water stains, smoke stains, or grease stains, the formula should have good enough coverage. Quality-wise, this primer for exterior wood is also resistant to blistering and peeling. It has an easy-to-apply formula that leaves fewer brush marks, giving it bonus points compared to the high hide. Pros. Resistant to mold and mildew. Works on multiple types of surfaces. Low toxicity and odor. Great stain blocking properties. Con. If you wish to change the color completely, you may need to apply multiple coats. Number 3. KILZ 58001 Exterior Primer Paint Next, we have one more product from Kills, namely, the Kills General Purpose Primer. Its stain blocking properties might not be as great as the High High Primer, but with a second coat, you can still work wonders. The formula of this exterior primer is quick drying, curing completely in just about 30 minutes to 1 hour. Because of this, it is a good option if you want to finish the painting project fast. The general purpose of Kills also works wonders in sealing porous surfaces. Just one gallon of this product can cover around 400 square feet of wood, allowing you to finish even the bigger projects. Similar to the other products we mentioned above, it has no harsh odors, making it a comfortable primer sealer to work with. 
Unfortunately, Kills General does not work the great on flooring or glossy surfaces. But since you will likely use it as an exterior wood primer sealer, this should not be a deal breaker. Pros. Clean formula with no harsh odors, superior sealing properties, dries within 30 minutes. Cons. Poor stain blocking properties, does not adhere well to glossy surfaces. Number 4. KILZ Adhesion L211101 Exterior Primer Paint. Porous surfaces are very difficult to deal with, which is why you need to look for wood primers with superior adhesion properties. This is why the Kills Adhesion High Bonding Latex Primer is such a great choice for old, porous wood. This product is highly versatile, as it doubles as both interior-slash-exterior paint primer. It also has a smooth formula that prevents bleeding. The Kills Adhesion can cover as much as 300 square feet per gallon. It may not seem like much, but unlike the Rust-Oleum Zinser Bullseye Primer, you will likely not need the second coat. Like the products mentioned above, the Kills Adhesion works on interior and exterior surfaces alike. You can also use it on surfaces that have been previously painted. Bear in mind that if you use a primer on this kind of surface, you would have to sand it as well. Pros. Adheres perfectly even on highly porous surfaces. Superior stain blocking primer. Prevents mold and mildew growth. Con. You will have to use a brush, as it is not very compatible with spray painting. Number 5. KILZ 2 Multi-Surface Exterior Primer Paint. In high humidity areas, exterior surfaces like would need something to keep the mold and mildew away. Thanks to its mildew-resistant film, the Kills All-Purpose can make sure the wood withstands harsh weather. Unlike the Zinser Cover Stain or the INSLX Prime Lock, this product does not have a strong odor. It also dries very fast, which means that you can follow up with the paint in as little as 30 minutes. This product is the perfect choice if you wish to use latex or oil-based paints. Plus, it efficiently adheres to any other surface. As a result, if you also want to prime some metallic handles after priming the wood, you can use the remainder of this can. With only one gallon of this product, you can cover a surface of 300 square feet. Pros. Dries very fast. Excellent mildew prevention properties. Great adhesion that prevents peeling. Con. It will likely need multiple coats. Considerations for exterior primer paint surfaces. Depending on the surface you are planning to do the paint job on, there are several considerations that you might want to keep in mind. Bare wood, exterior wood. If you are planning to prime paint bare wood, then you might want to use latex primer or an oil-based primer. If the wood surface has never been painted before, these primers will allow for it to adhere better to the surface. The wood durability will also increase this way. Painted wood, exterior paint. Painted wood can get chalky if you use the wrong primer. The best route here would be to use an oil-based primer, as it should provide a smooth finish. Plus, due to its denser formula, it's much more efficient at preventing imperfections. Stain-prone surfaces. Some surfaces are more stain-prone compared to others. This is why you might want to go for a stain-blocking primer if you have this problem. If you want to cover water-based stains, then you might want to go for a latex primer. With that said, if the stains are from grease or smoke, then you might want to go for an oil-based primer sealer instead. Glossy surfaces. Glossy primers are rather tricky, which is why you may want to go for a bonding primer. This type of primer was specifically made for glossy surfaces, as well as glass and plastic. The base does not matter, as long as it specifies it's a bonder as well. Exterior stainable wood. Exterior sustainable wood, just like bare wood, needs to be handled carefully. This is why you might want to go for an oil-based primer, or perhaps a shellac primer.